so we did the Vikings. Vikings Cove and the Nepto Temple. We did that. And then it says ship bound exploration. Because we just got the ship, is what we did. Craving some DD. Fucking Ronnie was in here earlier, really craving some DD. People are getting excited for DD. Gameplay gets better as you slowly, ever so slowly, leave tutorial mode and get all the pieces of the gameplay. But story lapses into stupidity. Maybe 13 will be so bad we'll just finish it and just say, um, fuck it. And just be done with it after we beat 13. Um, okay, so let's see here. A ship ship you could explore an entirely new part of the world you were previously unable to. Look around freely, but be warned, the enemies you will encounter are wholly tougher than anything you've thus far faced. Who's writing this guide, fucking Shakespeare Jesus? And you'll want to save often in the village of the ancients, which is located in the southwestern corner of your map on a circular shaped landmass talk to the residents and invest in any goods you might need there's a weapon shop armor shop magic items my nose is itching but i can't seem to get it scratched uh within the villages and you'll should naturally visit if you need to restore your party as well otherwise there's sadly little to do here, so I'll go check that out first. Let's do that. Is that about a true award-winning horror module? You're starting Curse of Strahd Saturday, Sunday. I want to pick up Curse of Strahd and read it, because I want to work it into uh, my Viking campaign world. I think it'd be cool if you guys like stumbled upon it and it's just slightly reworked. What I think I'll do, though, uh, the way that I will go about doing that, Oh my god, I didn't realize the continent. This continent's hard to read. makes it appear that I'm on a landmass. Or was that like deep water to shallow water? That map's hard to read. We work for sure because the idea behind Curse of Strahd is you have no escape as the Count has made his home in a pocket dimension where there is seemingly no way in or out. It's not just his house, it's the whole country. Hmm. Many new one game story is poorly written and makes the player characters out to be utterly thoughtless, but it's not quite mind-biddingly stupid. Let's take a look at the map again. This map doesn't make any sense. Oh, I'm starting to make sense of it now. What? What? Okay. I'm kind of like trapped in this little area. And I can't go to where this guy was talking because I can't get out of...
We be proud it's the character's hand been presented differently at first in the game. Often stupid, but how they're stricken. Explorer 53 wants you to explore, and to that end has provided you with a large playpen. Yeah, my point is that the the guy was mentioning visiting a village. In a specific area, I just can't. It's, it says a village of the ancients, which is located in the southwest corner of your map. Circular shaped landmass. Maybe he's talking about me walking there. Why would he put it in a chapter called ship exploration, though? You can go there over the line, yeah, that's what I just thought of. What's up? Finishers? I have no idea. Yeah, I guess I would have put it. I would have put it uh, at the end of the chapter previously. But Choco about Woods, come here, Choco about. Babe, you want to see the first Chocobo in Final Fantasy? You don't? You don't have a heart. What the hell? Is the whole world floating? Molly's upset. You like him? Is he cute? Just can't even handle it. Alright, babe. The whole continent is floating in the sky, guys. Village of the Ancients. Final Fantasy is the game for me. Check the closet. Light and our darkness have their own will and will transcend mortals such as you and I perpetually award the two crystals exist to bring balance between these two forces. Whoa, now that the balance is tilted towards darkness, four warriors of light will be chosen and tasked with bringing equilibrium to the world once more. Does that mean if it tips to the light that four warriors of darkness will be made? Could you imagine? The world is too good. Fine, whatever. I don't want to go that way anyways. Yeah. 
you believe if I told you that the ground we're standing on, this continent, was a loft? Rubbish, you say, well, it's none of this truth. Job Owen is a pillar. A pillar that supports our continent. Built by the ancients to bring balance between light and dark. Alright, uh... Okay, so... Equipped. 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 We don't have sight yet. Displays a detailed map? Cura. Buy that shit. Teleport. Buy that shit. Blind up. Buy that shit. Peace! Alright, so we're missing some level twos. Level job level sixteen white mage. Fifteen warrior. Twenty thief. Eighteen black mage. Sixteen white. Mage. Liking it. So you gotta do things as your class, it seems, to level them up. Because they all change their jobs at the same time, more or less. Yeah, but we got a varying of, like, four levels between them. So you gotta do stuff. But that doesn't make sense, because the Black Mage usually just swings and doesn't cast spells. And he's pretty high up there. Huh. Uh, Flame Mail is an upgrade. But they couldn't wear that. Two mage robes. Please. Oh, we're gonna be decked out, chat. Check this shit out. Viking axe and serpent sword. Such a badass. So, what are we gonna do if we don't want them to enter our house, but we want to make the place look like it's full of houses? Um, uh, jeez, I mean, we could put a, put a door there and just lock it. No, I don't think they'll like that. Uh, just turn the house around so they can't get inside the door. Perfect. Song straight up gonna put me to fuck to sleep. Jesus, that's expensive. I need a farm for some gold, guys. 